Hey, future doctors, I'm Dr. Simpson, founder of Top MD LLC, where we help you pass your boards and become confident, clinically sharp physicians. Today, we're tackling a high yield dermatology topic for your USMLE basal cell carcinoma versus squamous cell carcinoma. Let's break down the key differences, classic presentations, and must know board buzzwords. Let's go. First off, etiology and pathophysiology. Basal cell carcinoma, most common skin cancer, originates from basal cells of the epidermis, strongly linked to chronic sun exposure, especially UVB radiation, slow growing, locally invasive, but rarely metastasizes. Squamous cell carcinoma, second most common skin cancer, arises from keratinocytes, more aggressive than basal cell carcinoma and can metastasize, especially from mucosal surfaces or in immunocompromised patients. Associated with sun exposure, chronic wounds, scars, immunosuppression, and HPV. Next, clinical features and buzzwords. Basal cell carcinoma. Pearly, translucent papule with telangiectasia. May ulcerate. Rodent ulcer. Buzzword. Most common location. Face, especially upper lip, nose, and periorbital area. Squamous cell carcinoma. Firm, red, scaly nodule or plaque that may ulcerate. Buzzword. Carrot and pearls on histology. Tends to occur on sun-exposed areas like lower lip, ears, hands, and scalp. Next up is diagnosis. Skin biopsy is always first. Shave or punch biopsy depending on size and depth. Histology will confirm the type. Basal cell carcinoma. Basaloid cells with palisading nuclei. Squamous cell carcinoma. Invasive cords of squamous cells with carrot and pearls. Lastly is treatment basal cell carcinoma. First line, MUS micrographic surgery or standard excision. Superficial lesions, topical 5-FU or cryotherapy. Squamous cell carcinoma, excision or MOS surgery. Radiation for non-surgical candidates. Advanced metastatic squamous call carcinoma, chemotherapy or immunotherapy. Now for a quick risk factors recap. Shared risks, UV exposure. Fair skin, older age, unique for squamous cell carcinoma, chronic ulcers, immunosuppression, HPV basal. Cell carcinoma tends to be more local. Squamous cell carcinoma has metastatic potential. That's your rapid review of basal cell carcinoma versus squamous cell carcinoma. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe to Top MD LLC right here on YouTube for more high yield content that keeps you steps ahead in med school. Hit the bell so you don't miss our next clinical breakdown. We'll see you in the next one.